I'd like to introduce to you the newest product from Tsunami Compressed Air Solutions. It's a mobile dryer. It's called the Rove. This dryer is portable. You can take it and move it almost anywhere. Very simple to take out. Comes in a two-part system. One, basically you have your tank system. And then we have our portable regenerative dryer. Comes with quick disconnects. Uh, it's a complete system. It includes a ball valve for your inlet, a uh, tsunami water separator, tsunami oil coalescer, which takes the contaminants out before it gets into the dryer, goes through our tsunami twin tower dryer technology. The dry air flows out into the tank. We store 30 gallons of ultra dry air in the tank. We get dew points down to minus 80, depending on what the uh, airflow is, and humidity levels near zero. And then we put a outlet regulator on there so you can reduce the air pressure on your line going out to where you're going to be doing your work. We're going to take the Rove and we're going to bring it into this room here and we're going to hook it up to a standard compressed air system. What I'm going to show first is the quality of the air coming out of the compressed air system. We're using our humidity monitor. We're plugging this in and right now we're showing the humidity is uh, 24 it's growing, 25-26% relative humidity. Now what we're going to do is we're going to hook up the dryer. So we're taking the compressed air that was 26% relative humidity, connecting up to the inlet of the rove, pressurizing the rove. We're taking the rove and we're just plugging it into 110. So now the dryer is going to be cycling back and forth and now we can take the air coming off the outlet of the dryer and we can do the same, we can do the same test. And you can see we're dropping, we're at 13, 11, 10, 8, 7, 6 percent, 5 percent. one percent point nine percent basically we're less than one percent we're down to point five point two it'll go down to zero percent relative humidity by running through the rove showing ultra dry compressed air once you're finished with the rove uh, very simple there's only a couple things you want to do before you transport it to a, a separate off-site is you want to disconnect the quick connects disconnect the quick connect And now the dryer can simply be lifted off and placed in a vehicle and the tank can be rolled in. One other important point, when you're transporting off-site, there's a little petcock drain at the bottom of the tank and we suggest that you open that petcock up and drain the pressure out of this tank when you go to uh, move, move the uh, unit off-site.